Welcome back guys to episode 32 of Pokemon Reborn. Um, in the last episode, we defeated uh, Leader Adrian, which is pretty cool. Uh, so now we're heading out to the the desert region to face the next leader. I, I don't know which what's the next leader up ahead, but uh, I think it's the Steel type lady. Since we've already done, uh, well we haven't faced Rock, so I guess Rock could also be out here too. But uh, yeah, we already beat Ground, so I don't think Ground's gonna be out here. Uh, I, I'm just gonna apologize for not uploading an episode this last week. Just been a little bit busy, so you know, trying to slow things down a little bit. But uh, I wanted to put this episode out just so that, that nobody thinks like the playthrough just like abruptly ended. Now I'm gonna finish this game. Anyways, uh, if you liked the playthrough, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, share the videos in your local circle. If you have any fans of uh, this game, you know, I'd appreciate any support. And uh, let's get right into it. Now that this place is restored, I just have to hope that my son will come back to me. I like trains. I want to ride on one. I want to ride on two. At the same time. Uh oh. Hmm. Perhaps it's because we're the only re we only recently opened, but there's hardly any trains scheduled to come in. I mean, there's only only really one track. So, ticket purchase regions outside of Reborn. All tickets currently sold out. Promotional user authorized. Limited access available to the Tomorrowland Station. Would you like to purchase this ticket? Yes. All right. Hello. You see this beauty here? This is the first in a new line of trains will be rolling out across the city once we just secure the remaining fundings for it. The long awaited 9R, uh, 9R Thousand series. These babies are clean, lightning fast, and will take everyone to stations all across Reborn City faster than they can save modern locomotives. Look forward to it soon. Uh, Alright. Hey there. If you've never uh, ridden with us before, perhaps you'll never you've never seen the Grandview Station in action. May not look like much in uh, may not look like much in rest like this, but each of these platforms behind me is a, mar a marvel of engineering. A dozen more are stored below us, each of them able to rotate and shift aside to make room for as many vehicles as we might need to store. When it's time for departure, the proper platform rotates out to the next gate. Uh, so it's a junction. I know what a junction is. A turntable. In this station, the Grandview. In this way, the Grandview station is able to maintain a high capacity tra transportation network with just a fraction of the space of other region stations. It's about time this place got back on the way. Now that it's option again, you can bet I'll, you be, you can bet I'll be traveling all over the place. I got a bucket list to finish, you know. Fair. Employees only beyond this area. Yes, sir. All right, so I'm guessing this is where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, okay, yeah. Hmm. That's that's pretty cool. Tomorrowland Desert. Whoa, what? There's nothing here. Taka. I was really hoping you wouldn't show up. How are we doing this? But I... I'm sorry. I have to stop you here. If I don't... They're gonna say something like, there's no reason for me to stay, right? They're probably already... Or she's probably already watching us from, a, from, uh, from somewhere. I don't... I don't have a choice anymore. As if I ever did. This is... Alright. Definitely wasn't prepared for it, but I guess it is what it is. Uh, mini or ah, uh, why did I think? Yeah. Why is this Pokemon so annoying? 
I don't, I didn't, I could have went for Surf, but I felt like I wasn't going to one-shot it. And it knows Earthquake. Oh, man. Literally just got out here. Uh, not a fan of battles like that, where you're like, there's no prep time. Like, I didn't even know that was going to be there. It is what it is, though. I'm guessing she is probably like the Lin person. Lin makes the most sense. I mean, honestly, that's better than letting him fucking use, uh. Ugh. Water type moves are gonna suck out here. Didn't do as much as I thought it would. This is this is a fighting type, right? I'm not entirely sure. I think it is. Oh. No, it might be, it might be a normal type. All right, hold on. Change the weather. This Pokemon is frustratingly resilient. It's fat. Oh my. Okay. Let me, uh. Might as well just change the team. Uh. Freaking Poison Heal Gliscor on a Sandfield. Alright. Really want to do something with his Vulpix. Jeez, I don't... Yeah, I don't really have... B-Rabbit can be really good out there, just because of what he is, but... I don't really have any Pokemon that like excel on that field. At least I don't think so. Cause it doesn't increase ground damage dealt like or anything like that. Uh leading with B Rabbit it makes the most sense. Cause it can't get paralyzed. I mean, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, jeez. All right. Well, at least it's only plus one. Might be okay. Never mind. Yeah. Even that plus one, it just, it just everything dies. Oh yeah yeah yeah
this is kind of this is really frustrating. It's not even like I'm not catching and training Pokemon. I could see myself struggling if I were like trying to stick to a like a team of six, but I have a lot of Pokemon that I rotate in and out. Like the rotation tab, you uh, you can't see my cursor, but it's like right below the the party. Like I I don't even update it anymore because I have to go through so many Pokemon just for just to do this game. Like it's it's ridiculous. Oh, of course it did. I'll sack my Lucario if it means putting some damn. Oh! I'm not sacking anything. That should be faster than... Does he have anything that outspeeds speed rabbit Executor. Oh, shit. Strength? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, God, he has this annoying thing. Okay. So Z moves are a thing now. That freeze literally came in clutch. <laughs> Not against you. And not against them. So I guess that's it. This will probably be the last time you have to deal with me. Sorry. But you can. You've always been standing up to us. You've always been winning. You're going to keep doing that, aren't you? I have literally no choice. Yeah, you always do, huh? Did you ever even think to do anything else? Because I don't think I have. I never thought anything could change, but here you are. So this character is like... I understand the story arc they're trying to give this guy, you know, he, he's trying to come off as sympathetic because he never had the chance to be anything else other than, like, a bad guy, but the problem is, like, I don't know him before this. I, it's, it's one of those things where you're trying to give a character an arc, but they're not really, like, they don't have enough screen time to be getting this sort of attention. Like, he's been with Team Meteor from the beginning, but I don't know who he was before then. So, this idea that he never had anything else, I mean, I, I don't know. I don't really know this guy, like, what are his hobbies, like, what he likes, uh, what he likes. So, it, this kind of falls on deaf ears. But where does that leave me? When I go back, uh, when I go back a failure again, I won't get another chance. And you will keep fighting. Can I come with you? Okay. Yeah, sure. Really? Even after everything? Alright, here's the plan. I don't have a single clue, so I'm just going to follow you for now, okay? I'll try not to get in your way. And uh, I kind of took a bunch of healing items from base before they sent me here, so I'll hear your Pokemon whenever you need it. If I can find somewhere safe to hide, I think I'll lay low for there for a while. Maybe long enough that I'll get off of woman's, that woman's radar. After that, let's beat Team Meteor together. I'll follow your lead. I mean, I... I, I oh, this is interesting. None of that would have happened if it weren't for that woman. She's corrupted Team Meteor, both our ends and our means. Hmm. So I'm guessing he's talking about that Lin chick. She's a fucking fiend. So, I don't... I can see why he's, like, scared. Because if Ame was actually, like, good at her job and not completely, like, the, champ the champion because she did all the work to put the region together, then that's kind of crazy. Excadrill. Damn, dude. 
Let me see if I can catch one. Oh my god! Uh, I'd like to catch one, but, uh, chat out over here is fucking shit up. <laughs> it's level 66. Ew. Still, though, Excadrill is, like, really good. Fissure. Please stop. Oh, cool. They don't attack if you throw a Pokeball. Caught it. Nature is terrible, but sand rush is not. Sword stance, drill run. Could use some better moves though. But it's definitely a good Pokemon to have. Definitely a good move to have. So focus sash. Never wear a scarf to a desert. Yeah, I can see why that would be kind of a pain in the ass. I think this might be the l the last major... That's Scrafty, holy crap. This might be the last major, like, part of the region. Hmm. Because I think we've seen all, of the, all that's in the east. It's... Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, um... This is weird stuttering, I guess. It's the sand. Uh, where am I going, though? This place is so big. I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to be headed. Mana buzz. Oh, not bad. What's this over here? Relic copper? So you just pick up any old junk you find? I guess that's why I'm here too. Fair? Heliolisk. There's a pretty solid Pokemon out here. Crocodile. Darmanitan. Apparently there are also wild Charizards now. Kind of feel like I should be looking into that. But I just haven't. Okay. A place, some place to go. Whoa, this song. I, I, This song is familiar from another game I've played. I just can't believe they used it here. It doesn't really seem appropriate. A cavern in the sand, huh? I'm not sure how this place doesn't just cave in on itself. But I could say the same about myself. Seems good. I guess we'll. By the way, you're standing on me. By the way, like, <laughs> it's funny. A cavern in this man. Is this where we're supposed to go? Ooh, it's a shiny, but it's also a crustal, so I don't care. Where does this take me? Did you fall down here on purpose? We're never getting out of here now, are we? Dibs on the left side of the cave. 
I mean, I guess now I could probably, you know, that here's the here's the the chance for them to really develop him beyond my understanding. Can't really complain. Though the freaking wild Pokemon encounter feels kind of super high. Wait, isn't this the entrance? How do we get back up here? This, wait, what? Wait, so I went... I went down, and it sent me up. Okay. How does that... How? Why is that chat out so strong? Gosh. Doug Trio is the most annoying thing to find in the wild. Do I have any? What does this do? Just sells. I do. No, I didn't mean to step there. Wait, I think I know this place. Let's get a closer look. I was here before. The statue wasn't broken then. How long ago was it? Uh-oh. I don't think I can read this, but I can definitely recognize it. Why? There. Sh oh my god, there's a fucking RC statue. Here we go. I guess they flattened out to this slide, uh, flattened out to this slide to keep others out again. Again? Hmm. Can we look around some more? There's definitely a way to get past here. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, so it's probably something in the room. Maybe it's one of the statues now? No. Do I look around outside of the room? Oh, hell no. Alright, let's try going up to the north one. And take the ladders that we saw that one time. Here it is. What's over here? Fuck. Well, now I know. Don't go there. Okay. Oh. Oh. There's so many. game has a hard on for puzzles. Alright. Might as well try this one. Nope. Try this one. Nope. Man, it'd be nice if we just got like a a hint. <laughs> so I didn't have to 
uh, try all these? Oh my god. Wow, this shoutout's really good. Remember when I said I wanted to use a Pikachu in this game? Well, that was fucking insane. Like, I love Pikachu. Definitely not a good Pokemon, though. Oh my god. Let's try here. Okay. Well, it's different, but not at where we're trying to go. Uh, this episode might end up being just a much shorter, just because I'm, I'm, I'm putting up an episode just so that something goes out this week. But I'm also still kind of pressed for time. If that makes sense. So I don't want to. I don't want to get loose track. Eighty-six. Let's try the furthest. Have we tried this? Okay, yeah, I didn't expect it to be that simple. I don't know where it would be then. Oops. At this point, I don't even remember all the ones. I'm not even keeping track of the ones I've gone through. Uh, right here? I don't think I've gone through here. Yes, I have. That's where that link stone was. Oh, fuck. Uh, maybe? Okay. I don't even... Oh, boy. And Arena Trap. No future sight. This one, right? Yes. Okay, now this whole... fuck it. Yeah, I didn't expect it. I want to, I don't want to end the episode during this puzzle, because if I freaking, God forbid I forget. <laughs> I have to do this all over again. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't think it, a part of me thought it'd be like mirrored. Uh, Cario. Let's try over here. I mean, yeah. 
I, I, I think I'm pretty, like, it's, it's probably not going to be on the edges anywhere. Yes? Okay, thank you. Pretty sure it's just not going to be on the edges. Also, some of these flowers are like, they have hitboxes surrounding them, or like, collision. So you can't walk through them. Oh. Well, alright then. There's a second one? Okay. I think. Well, now, now that I, f is there anything else in this room? No, I'm not so sure. Oh. Draco plate. Maybe down here? Uh, we'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. And I uh, still don't know where to go. Curious if I should just look for stairs. Random pot. I'm gonna say, I'm pretty sure I came from there. And I'm out. Boy, is this place super duper convoluted. It's where I'm supposed to go, though. I need to take some time to desensitize one to play. Huh? Full Corona. Hmm. I don't really have a strong rock type, and this thing could wreck me. Levels are the only reason I didn't just get swept there. Let me see. Is this... I know I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go back to that cavern. I guess I can look around for a bit. Oh. Well, damn. Well, this place is almost nostalgic. Not that I've been here before or anything. But the smell of rust and concrete, and the thin layer of dust that tracks everywhere you step. I spent a lot of uh, I spent a lot of nights in a room like this. It's a... By the way, you're out here for a gym battle. Is there really a gym out in this clusterfuck? That's a good question. The engine's supposed to be functional. 
Hmm. Interesting. All right, I think I'm gonna end the episode here, just because like there's actually quite a bit I need to do in this desert. Um, in between going back to that one place. And uh, like I said, I, I'm, I'm kind of stripped for time. But if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.